do you blame Connor for UFC fighters wanting the box? Because he got a hundred million dollar payday. He <laughs> no, got a hundred million dollar payday. No, I, why, why would we blame? No, we don't blame him. You got a hundred million dollars. That's a hundred. Connor don't have to work no more. All right. That you, yeah. is, is that why he's been unsuccessful? He hasn't been the same fighter. It's yeah. hard. It's hard now. When you, when, there's a difference when I got on the Gucci. When I got on a, a Louis Vuitton robe, I got on mink slippers. And I got somebody bringing me all three of my meals in bed if I need that. I got a yacht. I got a Rolls. <laughs> I got a Ferrari. It's a, it's a, it's a, go, it's a good one. It's a good one. You're right. You're absolutely right. It's, it's, a, it's a difference. But I think it also depends on the, on the individual. Yeah. Because you mentioned because, Floyd. Yeah. Floyd had all that, and he's still going he's out there putting out the there, work yeah. in, giving folks the business. Exactly. It depends on the individual because some guys, they, 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 that's what they aspire to get. Right. So that's everything that they do, they do it for that. And then once they and get then it. once they get it, it's, uh, oh, I got it. Right. You know, and I think it was back in the day, whether it's Sugar Ray or maybe Haglo, and they said that it's things is different when you start sleeping on silk sheets. Marvin Haglo, because said that. yeah, so when you when you sleeping on that now, you know the the hustle is not the right. same, and now sleeping on silk sheets, <laughs> I, I have to say, uh, I still want, I still have that hustle. Right. I still, I still want to get up and go get it. Right. So I, I, I think it's. It's on the individual. So with him, I don't know why he, he's not that successful. You know, maybe maybe he got a lot of different things going on. He's right. got his demons that he's battling. Right. You know, I'm not here You're to kick. Conditioning. Yeah, you one not, trick party. Let's tell the truth. But I'm not. I'm not here to kick a man while he's but, down. But that's the best time to kick know, a man. I that, can't think of a better time to kick a man. He right. It's easiest. He close. It's easiest to he get him. Right there. <laughs> but he one trick. He he never evolved. The same thing happened to Ronda Rousey. She didn't evolve. He didn't evolve. He's striking. Take him to the ground. He never gets up. He spent, if you take him down to the mat, 30 seconds into the round, he down the rest of the round. He down the rest, you see that. They take him out to deep water and they drown him. Khabib told him what he was gonna do. Oh, yeah. He said, I'm gonna drag you to the deep and I'm gonna drown you. Yeah, no, I mean, I mean, it that's the thing about this sport is you have to be honest with yourself. Right. You have to be able to understand that I'm weak in these areas. I need to make sure that I, I'm bringing those up to par. So by the time I step out there, like that's what people don't realize. It's not just oh, I, I won this fight. Right. It's I want to be the best mixed martial artist in the planet. Right. And and that's being able to mix it all up together. You got to be good at everything when you step in there. And that's what I think I do better than everybody right now. Right. Would you fight Connor? Would you fight Khabib? I would not fight Khabib. Okay. You know, Khabib is like my brother. Okay. You know, I see no interest in that. Connor, absolutely. I gave him a chance. He got scared, huh? He, I gave him a chance. He was, he was barking. He was, because he, that's what he do now. He tweet a lot. Yeah. And we call it Twitter fingers now. He, he tweeting a lot. And so he, one time, uh, before I fought Masvidal, right? He was, he was, he was tweeting a lot. And I said, here's your 